Stop worrying about what other people are doing. Hey guys, I am back again and welcome back to my channel. I told y'all I was giving the girls weekly content and I am not coming to play, period, okay? Period. And today I'm here in my Minding My Girl Boss Business sweatshirt and look, let me know if y'all wanna see these for Black Friday cause I don't know sis, I'm trying to see, look. Is this what the girls need? Just look, let me know. Let me know down in the comments. Stop now. Let me know if this is what you want to see. And I'll add it along with the Female Hustler sweatshirt for Black Friday. These will be limited edition. I will not bring them back. So look, just, just let me know what y'all trying to do. Let me know, sis. Let me know. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys ways to stay motivated as a small business owner because look, we are in a pandemic. We're in the middle of election year. We got jobs. We in school, sis. We are working. We trying to build these brands. Look, it's so easy, y'all, to get discouraged and get dismotivated, or excuse me, get unmotivated, and just say, look, forget it. I don't have time today. I'm not in the mood. Forget this brand. Forget this life I'm trying to manifest. Forget all my dreams and goals. Look, we're not doing none of that, okay? We are not putting none of our dreams on hold. I'm not, I don't care about no pandemic. I don't care about no election. Look, we're not letting none of that stop us. So if you see me looking down at my phone, it's because I have the notes in my phone because look, I cannot forget nothing for the girls, okay? So let's just jump right into this video. Before we get there, make sure you subscribe because I know this is the second video you done watched. I know you heard me spill the tea about my business. If you didn't, go back. Go back, sis, because you missed the other one. Make sure you go subscribe, like this video, like the other video. Leave a comment, you know, show us some love. You know, that's all I'm asking. I don't ask for much, okay? So I'm gonna get right into the tips, so. The first way to stay motivated is clean up your social media. Look, you on Instagram all day long, you on Facebook all day long, you on Twitter all day long. I know this because I'm you. I look, I'm on social media all day. One thing I do not play about is who I follow. I'm not following no drama, I'm not following no mess, I'm not following nobody who's gonna make me feel like. Like, I don't have my life together. I follow girl bosses. I'm talking personal page, business page. I do not play. Clean up your social media, sis. You so stressed and unmotivated because you was following sis that done got 45 surgeries thinking that you need to go get your body done like sis. Clean up your social media. Clean up. I know, I know you want to stay in the loop. I know you want the tea. I'm not even going to lie. I still follow the shade room. I catch some of the tea. Some of the tea I have to scroll past because... I'm not trying to have that stress me out. Clean up your social media. That's all I'm saying. I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't even gonna force you. I ain't gonna say nothing else. Clean up your social media, sis. Okay. Thank you. The next way to stay motivated is remember why you started. If you started your business because you want to be rich, <laughs> because you think you gonna make six figures in 10 minutes like you super sick, like sis, let me tell you something. If you started your business to make money, you started for the wrong reason. I'm, I'm just going to save you months of spending your money and investing. Like, just let it, just look, sis. <laughs> Relax. Look, remember why you started your business. If you are not starting your business based off of passion, it's not going to work, sis. I'm telling you, I know that. Even if you do make a little bit, even if you do make a little bit money, I ain't gonna say everybody gonna be broke. Everybody ain't the same. Most people gonna be broke. On average, businesses don't even make money in that first one to three years. On average. Anytime I'm like, look, I don't feel like posting today. Look, the girl about blueprint can kiss it. I am not in the mood. I'm like, well, I like to do this. I know I'm gonna wanna talk about business. I know I got some stuff to say. I see the problem on Instagram. It takes me 10 minutes at most to make a post and a caption. If I'm not motivated, that's my motivation. Like I know exactly why I started this business because this is what I like to do. I like to help people. I like to talk to women. If you are ever unmotivated in your business, remember why you started. What was your reasoning behind it? Did you start your makeup brand because you wanted dark skinned women to be able to find makeup in their shade? Now you unmotivated. You're not helping them women, sis. You leaving all this. You leaving all your reasons behind. Remember why you started your business. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. The next way to stay motivated is set reachable goals. 
don't be out here talking about you wanna you wanna make five hundred dollars in your Black Friday sale and you're not even making fifty dollars a week. What? Like, of course you're gonna be unmotivated. You're not reaching your goals because they're not realistic. Like, well, set reachable goals. Set reachable goals. Uh, my next my next way to stay motivated kind of plays into this because on top of setting reachable goals celebrate your wins sis why are you sitting around looking mad because you don't have 10k followers but you got 800 three weeks ago you didn't have 800 like why are you not excited your business is growing sis you cannot expect to grow overnight that is the problem that's the problem you cannot expect to grow overnight celebrate your small wins i was excited at 300 followers i was excited at 500 followers i was hyped for a thousand followers on the girl box blueprint listen you cannot tell me nothing i knew i was on the rise period now i'm at 4,000. excited excited because in january i didn't have no followers so celebrate your small wins don't let little stuff you're like mm, well i only have 800 followers That's 800 more than you had when you started sis when you launched you had zero celebrate your small wins like be happy for yourself don't don't put so much pressure on your business that you're not happy for the progress you're making you're gonna always be sad you're gonna always be unmotivated because it takes time to get there it just takes time the fifth way to Stay motivated in your business is to focus on yourself and not what other people are doing. Because again, you get on Instagram and you see people and it, it looks like to you they blew up overnight. They started the business, they went viral, and now they're making six figures. I promise y'all it didn't happen like that. I promise. I promise. I promise. Social media is really good about making it feel like everybody doing it. Everybody making six figures. You should be making... You, look, stop focusing on what everybody else is doing. Look, focus on yourself, sis. Focus on yourself. Focus on yourself. Celebrate your small wins. Be proud of what you're doing and where you're going. And stop worrying about what other people are doing. You're not them. They are not on the path that you are designed to take. Their path might lead them to success a little bit quicker because their business is going to burn out way faster. You know what I mean? You are so worried about what other people are doing to make money and how other people are being successful. And they sell this product, so I have to sell this product. No. No, sis. Stop worrying about what other people are doing. Stop worrying about what other people are doing. Thank you. <laughs> so, the next tip. Take breaks when you need to. I don't know who started the whole idea that to be a millionaire, you got to grind 24 hours and millionaires don't sleep because I'm up before the birds at two in the morning working on my business i didn't go to sleep look i'm tired so <laughs> if you need to take a break take your break i would rather you take a break today than work 24 hours 24 hours i'm grinding i'm grinding i'm doing this i'm hustling i'm on my stuff and now you burnt out after two weeks because you don't use all your energy so once you get burnt out, now it's going to take you another two weeks to recover. Now all that you did for them two weeks, now your consistency is down. Your engagement is down. People are like, what happened to her? Where she been? She was everywhere. Now she gone. Look, take breaks. One thing about me, I'm going to take a break. I do not play about my mental health. If I if I feel like, look, I'm getting exhausted. I'm doing too much. One thing about me, I'm going to sit my butt down. Okay? I'm not going to stress myself out because I know my purpose. I know where I'm headed. I know what I'm capable of. If I need to take a day, I'm gonna take a day, sis. I'm gonna take a day. Take your day. Don't let nobody make you feel bad because you need a break. Hmm. There's a really good quote from Eric Thomas. If you don't watch Eric Thomas, he's the best motivational speaker, well, to me. He said a quote, millionaires don't work, they think. Think about that. I'm gonna give some time to think, really think about that. Millionaires don't work, they think. It all starts in the mind. Take your break, Re relax your mind because otherwise, what was your purpose? Like, now you just tired, burnt down, you still broke. Like, relax, just relax, okay. Another way is to make it fun. So, when you are unmotivated, and I guess this kind of goes along with remembering why you started, but make it fun. 
making fun stop focusing on the money a lot of times when people are unmotivated it's because they feel like they're not where they want to be they're not reaching their goals they've invested all this money they haven't seen a return on their investment yet like stop focusing on all that make it fun this is why you have to have a business that you actually like not a business that you're in for money make it fun make it fun go live and talk to your father laugh and kiki all day long and build your brand like that you don't have to sit there and i'm gonna make this ebook and i'm gonna create these colors and i'm gonna order this and i have to be up at midnight because in china that's when they're working in the fact like make it fun sis go live go live and do your makeup if you have a cosmetics brand go live while you're doing your makeup you're gonna do your makeup anyway go live and engage with your followers see what they're talking about and i don't care if you have two people on the live save the live because you know people are nosy they gonna go watch it and the next time you go live they're gonna say well the last time when i went back and watched it she was lit on live she was playing music she was dancing do it again Keep doing it. Consistency. Remember why you started. And make it fun. Like business, it's work, but it should be fun. You should genuinely enjoy what you do. That is my life goal. To enjoy what I do. Okay. Another way, if you're unmotivated, another way to stay motivated is to change your settings. And what I mean by that is, you wake up in the bed. You go take a shower. You get in the bed and get on your laptop to do your work. You get on, you in the bed to watch TV. You in the bed talking on the phone. Now you in the bed trying to go to sleep and you wonder why your mind not resting. You're not motivated because you haven't went nowhere. You've been in the room all day. How are you motivated? Go sit outside, sis. Go to somebody else's house. Get a desk. Get a little office space or something. It don't even have to be fancy. I'm in a tin chair from Walmart right now. I am not playing with y'all. It don't take much. Y'all are worried about, well, I don't have this. I don't have that. What do you have? I know you got something. You have something. Make it like sis, you have to make it work. Change your setting. Once you change your setting, your mindset change. You feel refreshed. You're in a different environment. You're not in the same mundane area. Change your setting, sis. The last way I'm gonna say I'm gonna say to stay motivated is find your circle, find your girl group. One thing about me, look, if I'm not feeling it, I can text my best friends. And say, look, this is how I'm feeling. One thing about them, they're going to hype it up. Don't don't feel like that because this, and you should just worry about this. And you've already done this, and we're proud of you that, like, find your circle. Get you some best friends. Get you some friends. Get you some real friends. And that's T. Get you some real friends. Find your circle. Friends. When I text my friends, or when we have our little debriefs on FaceTime, look, after that, I'm good. I'm, I'm refreshed. I'm like, okay. Whatever slump I was in was going. When I see my friends, it is all and popping. Listen, I'm waiting on a girl's trip right now. I'm going to Tennessee to my best friend's house. And when I tell y'all I need this break, I need this to literally relift my spirits, make me remember who I am. Like, find some friends like that. That's what you need, y'all. That's what you need. I might even vlog. I don't even know. I don't even know if I want to vlog on YouTube, but I might even vlog that trip so y'all can see that's it's just you have to find people that make you feel like that when i see them i'm like cool it's on and popping when i get back i feel like i don't i'm just going to her house we're not going to vegas we're not going to miami i'm going to her house i need this trip when i come back you're gonna think i went to new york okay period find you some friends like that so Thank you guys again so much for watching again let me know in the comments if i should add these um for Black Friday and I might, I might give the girls what they want okay thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like leave a comment you know just let me know how you feeling today how your motivation is you know whatever let me know something uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel and as always make sure you follow me on Instagram at the girl boss blueprint my personal page is at Ebony K Thomas make sure you go to my website see what I got going on I got some new stuff coming for November period okay and thank you guys so much for watching as always i love you so much bye